I am who I am, I don't need to be perfect. Be patient, good baby, you see that I'm worth These bitches don't love me, they wishing and hoping. I give them a baby, they know that I'm worth it. Big blood got a job, but you know that I'm perfect. Can't fuck with these niggas, they making me nervous. I got that guy, and that come get you serving. You moving too fast, don't make me hurt. You. Good morning, good morning, good morning. It's your boy EJ back with another video. You want to I don't understand. Anyway, man, I'm showing y'all my boys, man. Hey! No! 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 Alright, dog. I'm gonna turn up. My boys, man. Hey, y'all. These are all boys, y'all. These are all boys. So what right else, y'all? Boys, y'all. He the same color as his mama. He the only one that's dark. He the only boy that is dark. All right, I gotta go outside. Uh, check out my pup pups. I'll catch you guys in the next scene, man. I'm cleaning out the, all the kennels outside. I'll just bring the boys in. It's like around 9 a.m. and it's already super hot outside. So as you guys know, it's daytime. Boys in the crib. Also, I'm still waiting on my kennels to be here. The stackable kennels. These are not the stockable kennels, y'all. These just my regular kennels that I already had. I just brought the boys inside to put them in there. These are the four boys that's available. Ooh, these dudes gonna be big, man. Hey, boys. Hey, boys. Hey, boys. Catch you guys in the next scene. All right, all right, all right. As you guys see, all the kennels are clean. Give me about 30 minutes. Get me back how they was before I clean them. That's the way it go, man. Boy. Look at structure. Oh. 
Oh my god. I'm gonna make this up, man. Let's do it right there. Yes, sir. You see that girl right there? Do they real wet? Is everyone want a little water? Y'all better get used to that water, man. That water's sitting y'all right. Yeah, um, hey, mama. Hey, baby. All right, so yeah, starting this upcoming week. I am bringing dog park videos back. I'm going to start getting up around 6.30 a.m. Start taking two dogs to the park at a time. Got to be out there about around 7.30, 8. Before the sun really hit. So we're just going to get back to doing how we used to do. I used to go to the dog park middle of the day, nighttime, all type of stuff, man. It was just it was a different type of climate. But we're going to get back to... Uh, I would not let this heat defeat me. Got to get back to being how we was, man. Got to get back to the normal routine of EJ, man. And I know my dog's going to appreciate it as well. Hey, Katrina. Hey, girl. Oh, that coat feel good. As you guys know, man, we no longer... Uh, we no longer using the, uh, I don't use it, I, I, I didn't, I didn't, uh, got rid of it, uh, I didn't got rid of it so quick that I can't even tell y'all, uh, I can't even tell you what the name of the dog food I was using. Um, uh, sport mix, woo! No more sport mix in NBL camp, man. Only high quality dog food from now on, man. When I tell you, don't ever let nobody tell you dog food don't mean nothing, man. And I'm not, I'm not talking about structure or anything like that because that shit completely, completely genetics. But when I tell you the the health, the, ah, damn it, Navy used to do that shit. God, do not run into my knees, Katana. My knees cannot go back. That's what I'm saying. Um, when I tell you the health of your dog starts with the stomach of your dog. You know what I'm saying? They get raw too. Uh, I, I could have done a raw feeding video. Where I fed all the dogs raw. They tore it up, but I did do that. It was good. Um, the poop wasn't bad. Wasn't no, no diarrhea came from it. If you go by, if you go to the store, and you decide you want to buy chicken and raw chicken and all that for your dog, please. This is very, 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 very important information. Freeze that fucking chicken, man, for at least two to three days, man. I'm talking about freeze it, man. When you give it to your dog, do not give it to him thawed out. When you thaw out raw meat, you're giving a chance for parasites to start to, you know, form inside the, uh, inside the dog food. It's all parasites ain't bad, but it's best, it's best to give it to them a little bit frozen, man. You want to make sure that when you're giving them the, giving them the raw food that's been frozen for days and you're giving it to them a little bit frozen, man, that make a complete difference in how they stomach react to it. Katana, let's go! 
Let's go. Also, uh, so right now we feeding Victor. We feeding Victor. I, 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 so I went and got the pro plan. The pro plan is a good dog food. I'm not going to, I can't kick pro plan as it's not a good dog food. Pro plan is like one of the best dog foods. But it's hollow. It's, it's, it's still too hollow for me. Um, the poop, uh, the uh, the poop come out really soft with uh with the pro plan, which isn't a bad thing. You kind of want the you kind of want the poop a little bit soft, but I don't like it that soft. I kind of like the poop to be a little bit hard. Like if they poop with the victor, give it thirty minutes after they poop. I ain't gonna pick the victor up with my hands, throw it away. No residue on my hand. It's that dry. No residue. It's easy to clean up. It's almost the easiest to clean up. Like, I just cleaned out all they kennels. First off, when I open the door up, I make them all stay in their kennel while I clean. Uh, for me, it's, I don't, I could let them all run out and all that, but then it just be too much. So what I do is, I'm, it's new, you know how I'm doing it. I leave them all in the kennel, I open the door to the kennel, tell them no, they back their ass up in the corner, I go in and scrape up all the dupe. It's so easy to clean, man. Only thing that makes it hard, makes the poop hard to clean with the puppies is that the puppies actually step in it. And that goes into my second thing. The reason I leave them in the kennel while I clean, because after I clean up the poop, I spray the kennels out and I can spray their feet off from stepping in it. You know what I'm saying? So I would, I used to let them out, clean all the kennels out. Then when I put them back in the kennels, I see shit on their feet. I'm picking them up, there's shit on the bottom of them. And it's like, damn, I cleaned the kennels, but they still dirty. So what I do is I clean the kennels, scrape a bottle of dookie, then I go back and spray them off and spray the kennels off. So I'm cleaning the kennels and I'm cleaning them off as well. Also, I'm cooling the garage. Um, I'm cooling them in the garage. That's why you don't see none of them in the garage panting. None of them pant because they're getting cooled by the water and they're getting their feet cooled off. It's very important to make sure your dog feet and all that stuff is clean. I don't really like uh, poop on the feet. I, and I don't mind on the feet if they was actually could go to a spot where they can get it off their feet. That's what I'm saying about that is like dirt. If they step in poop and some dirt, them walking in the dirt, playing around, feet clean. Concrete still be on their feet so that's how we're doing it man we go in clean up all the poop spray the dog's feet off spray them off and uh we're gonna move it like that i will let them out don't don't get me wrong they 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 will come out the kid on today um i'm right here with the tunnel right now they will get a chance to come out and play and run around and do their little dog stuff but i just want to clean their feet first so i'll catch you guys in the next scene all right yeah i'm back in my office man Hey, dude. Let the juice, man. Get some air, man. You guys know, man. My dog's inside, man. All right, so. What I need to do is. As you guys know, I got two of the boys that got their ears cropped. They, put, they got the ears stretched, meaning they got re-stitched. So I need to take both of them boys to go with the stitches taking out their ears. Also, figure out what's going on with their ears because they, one, they, one of their ears still down. I don't like that. I paid a lot of money for their ears to be straight. So we're going to get that done today. Also, when Katana got here, she still has stitches in her ears. Um... I've been meaning to take her to go get a to go get those stitches removed too. So I'm gonna take Katana with me today and the two boys and get those stitches removed today. So we're gonna do that today. I also need to take back, I need to go back to Home Depot and take back that uh oh boy, find a seat, man. Oh, no. I need to go take back uh I need to take back that uh that hardware car because I was gonna build my own kennel, but I decided not to. I just bought one, so I need to take back the hardware car and get that money back from that. 
So we got a well, first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna go to Home Depot, take back that wire, and then we're gonna shoot well to the place where I got that ears crop and get all the stitches taken out of the boy's ears and figure out why his ears still like that. And uh Should I just make this one on video or should I cut it right now? Thumbs up right now. Leave a comment right now if I should make this a longer video or should I cut it right now? Hit the thumbs up button right now. Thumbs up right now. Alright, now that y'all hit the thumbs up button, and I appreciate y'all, man. Thank you so much for hitting the thumbs up button. I'm going to take y'all with me to go take the back the hard wet cloth, and I'm going to take y'all with me to go take, matter of fact, I'm not going to take the hard wet cloth back today, because that would cause me having to leave the car running. Um... Or just leaving the dog inside the car while running the stove. And uh, we're not doing that. So what I'm going to do is, I'm going to just take the dogs to uh, take the dogs to get their ears, uh, get the stitches out of their ears. And uh, and when we, uh, when we get done with that and I get the dogs back here at the crib, we uh, we'll figure out the hardware cloth because I don't want I don't want to have to run in the store and leave them in the car and leave my car running and somebody come take the car and, or them just being in the car too long and they decide that they want to you know piss in, inside the car and uh so we, we want to avoid that so the place opened up at 3 o'clock it's currently 10.30 so, I'm going to go on in this video, man. I'm going to go on in this video, man. Um, next video is going to be taking them to get their ears. Stitches taking out their ears. And uh, I'm going to go get collars. I'm going to get collar, new collars for all the dogs, all my keepers. Navy need new collars, Zeus need new collars, Rocks need new collars. The turn of knees a collar. And then my keeper male, my keeper male Rocky need a collar. My keeper female Hazel need a collar. All the keepers gonna get collars today, so we're gonna go, we're gonna go get collars. And uh, that'll be a whole nother video, man. So please like, comment, and subscribe. Um, we're gonna keep rolling, man. We're gonna keep it rolling. Also, I do have. Um, a few puppies available, as you guys know, I have four males available, four tri males from Zeus and Nyla, XL's big, bo big boys. Also, I have a female available from Zeus and Nyla, one female. Also, um, I have uh, two blue farm females from Navy available, man. If you understand one of those dogs, everything you need to know will be in the description. I'll catch you guys in the next video, man. As you guys know, love, peace, man. Be kind to each other, man.